What's good, YouTube family? This is your guy, Bless One. Um, thank you for joining another episode of I, S I Smoke Hip Hop. I gotta go somewhere, but I didn't talk address this yesterday. Um, this guy never um, really started trouble with people like that, other than his outgoing wars with Angry Fan and Wing, and you know, the, the whole downfall of that. Other than that, um, PSA Radio stayed out the way, so I'm making a PSA message. Um, <laughs> Finally, really did it. You maniacs! You blew it up! Ah, oh, damn you! God damn you all to hell! Goodbye! Goodbye. No use leading with our chins. This is where our story ends. <sighs> Another one. It's like one by one by one, they're all going down. I'm sitting here to be honest with you guys. I'm like in victory because I know my page is going to come down soon. To be real, it's like, what's taking y'all so long? That also shows credit to my character in Battle Rap. Like when you care and you only care about the income you're getting, this is gonna devastate you. <laughs> Thank God I don't monetize my videos, I love hip hop. But with that being said, respect the three letter man. I've always told you I respected you more as a sports blogger, but respect to your hard work ethic in Battle Rap. I'll explain why. Right now I wanna celebrate um, a great honor in watching your content. Um, as you can see, I followed your tweets, I followed you even when you commented on ESPN, I've always came and commented over there. Um, I've always showed love, man. I've always went to the late night appreciation videos, et cetera, et cetera. Although we had our tits for tats since 2013 till now, because you were, I understand just like the Tony Bro situations, you were representing who you're aligned with, which was Caps. Um, right now I got this. I don't know if y'all know what it is. It's a wine, anyways, forget that. And it's a red wine. We're just gonna drink for you, man. This for all the fallen homies. Let me say it properly. This for all the fallen bloggers who left this battle rap YouTube content too soon, man. How do I say goodbye to what we had? The good I don't know where to rule. Well, wait, wait a minute. So you just flash that thing, it erases her memory, and you, you just make up a new one? A standard issue, man. Ten too soon, man. It's a damn shame what you flaggers are doing. I'm not talking amped up because I'm just trying to vibe with you guys right now. Let's smoke up right quick, man. Shouts out to the plug. I'm going to get on and talk about how I feel about PSA Radio. Listen, three. Three later, you are influential in this culture. A lot of people don't even know how you started and when you started. I remember. 
Even before Caps brought you along, you used to be on Shots 97 all the time, going back and forth with Star in the morning. I remember you and Star went at it and you never went back to the show for almost like six months. <clears throat> and Star kept saying, I want to have three letter men mad at me and blah, 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 where's three? And the fans such as myself and others, we flooded <coughs> angry fans, radio's original comment sections. That's when Caps, Three Letter Man, Timbo, and Wings were together. And Three Letter Man responded back to Star. That was appreciative, man. I'm not one of these brand new bloggers who are new in the culture trying to come at me, man. I want to say something, but I don't want to get in trouble because these guys are not built like, like our era. J Black said something special in one of his um one of his uh, posts. And this is the video J Black also had. See what J Black wrote? He wrote, just need the energy to be the same. Go ahead and add angry fan with any. Shaking my head, GIF, you can find. And I don't care how old it is. My error don't flag S. Champions don't flag S. And you emailed me because I don't check DMs. Damn. Now let's rewind this. Oh, it's not a uh, Photoshop or anything like that. As you can see, this is my finish line. I'm bringing up and down. Kyrie's, Jordan's, they're going in and out. Let's type the name real fast. As you can see, the date is 6 4 16. We kept the five. That's under two years. That's a year and a half. Um, the reason I'm doing this, the reason I started going at Cap, so this is about Cap. So to read the rest. I don't have time for that. I have like all the battle rappers and the craft you all come up with. If he feels himself too much, unless I feel like the like he's disrespecting the game of battle rap, which you were a Cap, let's be real. You said it yourself. I had a master plan. So you guys blame everybody, champion, all these guys. A flag, a flag attack. Tell me that it wouldn't last. Had to switch up, look at things different, see the bigger picture. Those were the days, hard work forever pays. Now I see you in a better place. These guys are not real money. Like our era, J Black said something special in one of his um, one of his uh posts, and this is the video J Black also had. As you see that video, J Black was stating that. In our era, we didn't we didn't have flaggers. We didn't. Y'all know what we was doing in our era? We had crazy things going on in our era. Even battle rappers had to take it on the chin. Pause. Even the battle rappers went about that flag and stuff. We had so many scandals in battle rap from 2011, 12, 13, 14. Remember Jesse Reekin, Battle Rap Arena? <clears throat> I'm gonna keep it a fact. Even that so-called criminal if he is one chris i'm biased his face group when it originally started these coon gang niggas whether i talk crap about them or not like i'm it's like i feel like we're losing our our memories of battle raps man psa you you've done us just dudes but i feel like man it's wrong man like whether we like you or not or like you it doesn't really matter nobody should have put you in a situation where you lost your channel and I don't know what happened, and you guys can see that I'm one of the bloggers gonna be honest. Like, I can't tell you who exactly is doing it, but I can find some of them. Because some of them are idiots that leave trails. Like, they tell on themselves. Coon Gain asked Battle Truth yesterday on the live. I'm not gonna put Battle Truth face or image because this guy scares me. He added him a question. He said, Your channel is not deleted, it's private. Battle Truth keeps saying it's deleted. It's not deleted, guys, it's private. If it was deleted, it would have said terminated under YouTube guidelines. And when Battle Troop excuse was, I don't know, I don't know how to use YouTube. You just told on yourself right there. That means it's got to be Hector Sanchez, his producer. Your One United Front, my nigga, has a lot to do with a lot of flags. But I must fall back because I already know they're flagging my videos. I showed you guys all of it. We're going to contest and get into things right now with a firm grip on appreciating Three Letter Man. Three Letter Man, I came at you over the years. But well, we all got older together over the years. Although you're from New York, you're also from Miami, so we're similar. I'm from Miami and Broward County, and it's like I got you know ties in New York as well from family and me living over there. So we're vice versa. 
that's why I never really had odds with you like that. If I called you out or anything like that, it was always based on Angry Fan 007. So your channel should have never be taken down. I, I wanted to know who placated you between this War of the Bloggers. War of the Bloggers took a lot of casualties. Although I always put my humorous um, banner that's showing War of the Bloggers. Humorous um, banner that's showing War of the Bloggers. It's not really funny at all. You were detrimental to the cultures, man. I still remember when Angry Fan came out with his own um, station and he took you and recruited you from um, Star in the Morning. And I knew who you was, but a lot of these battle rap fans didn't know who three was, man. And and you had battle rappers calling in like Goods and Murder Mook. Everybody thought Three Letter Man was um. Uh, angry fan, that shit used to have me dying, man. Oops, I said the S word. I know you're gonna flag that, but that had me dying, man. That had me dying. I know y'all gonna say I have the um, K Shine herpes. Unfortunately, guys, I'm a lame. Uh, <laughs> I burned my own self. Anyway, that's another story. I'm gonna save that for the other blog. That's gonna. That actually was recorded on video. But anyways, it's sad that you're gone. Um, not sad like that. I ain't gonna be all extra. Like, I'm gonna keep it a stack. You didn't really show love like that my way. Pause. But I, need is here and there. I, I, I'm not a dude that get in his feelings like that. I you seen. I always kept showing you love, and you know that too. So you know I couldn't possibly be a flagger if I'm always watching your videos. I'm always in your content and not hating. You gotta watch a lot of people. But to be real, I don't know how you're gonna pinpoint it. And if y'all wanna say it's me to make you feel better, go ahead, man. But believe it or not. I wish that on nobody. I came from y'all era. Tell me one, which one of us niggas from that 2012 era to now, fuck it, that 2011 era of blogging, not battle rap. I've been in battle rap longer, but that 2011 era of Facebook groups of um, bloggings and all that and all the way to now, which one of us in our era that you can say do things like that? And it's not me. Y'all already know I'm not part of these new cats. These new cats came with a new wave of thinking this. Like, it's the, the thing that's brand new. Although some of it was entertaining, but not the flagging part. I'm talking about the viscerals and the attacks and coming at a dude, pulling up, that type of stuff. But taking channels down, that's the equivalent of snitching. I'm going to be real. That's not in my bones. Like, me and my family took a lot of lumps fighting her and stuff, never calling the cops. And I'm, I'm not trying to say you should call the cops, not call the cops, but I wasn't built like that. And I understood if I called the cops, this would happen to me every day, if not more or worse, due to the neighborhood I lived in. So it made me immune to calling for help. I just took my lumps and bruises like a man with my chin up, chest out, like Bosco 100 like to say. And I walked this scorch of the earth on my own. Never have told. Yeah, you dudes are taking channels down. Salute the PSA radio, man. Hope to see your page in another page sometimes, but it's gonna hurt you right now. And I can tell you the downfalls is you're gonna feel sick and you got income out of it. So I'm pretty sure it had some type of effect. And let's just be real, you love battle rap like me, so I know, let's just put the money part away. You're just gonna be hurt, something you do every day, you're getting older, so it's something fun, like you were in your comfort zone and battle rap was there. People say, people like me and you, this is our life. Well, it is our life, battle rap is my life. Do I have another life too? Yes, just because it's your life don't mean you don't have another life. It's just that we incorporated so much of battle rap into our daily parts, which is right here in our rooted in our hearts. And for somebody to pull it out based on words, and some of it is just based on, I want to see how much disaster I can cause in the culture. And it's like, what next? And if it is URL having something to do with it, which I can't fathomly um, have a thought to see that but if it is the url come on bros but i like i said why would the url do that if they need the bloggers so they're not dumb bees then them try to be cordial to such the likes of angry fan and others so I, I don't know i just don't see it i think it's deeper than what we're thinking that's why i said stop narrowing it down to one person you're giving avenues and lanes for other people to jump in and attack it without being um uh, uh, having a flashlight highlighted on them all of us been accused including me so i know how it feels to be accused but to be real i don't really get mad in fact i want y'all to accuse me i don't really care i love batter i'm gonna show you how much i love it so much after you guys take this channel down because i know you're gonna take it down after it's taken down i'm gonna grind again and show it again i said this every time when you see strikes going up like that you know the end has come the end has come but i love it Soon you're gonna see me doing one of these vlogs for me. That's the funny part. It's gonna be I Smoke Hip Hop, the end has come. I low key said that on purpose so one of you guys can take this video and do it. I Smoke Hip Hop, the end has come. It's gonna happen. I'm real enough to talk like that. I'm just keeping it a G. I 
I knew what I was getting myself into when I joined Battle Rap Blogging, guys. This ain't new. What I'm looking at it at is like the racial war between police and people in impoverished areas. And it's like, it took y'all having cell phones to realize what was being harassed and abused and, and killed out here. Well, this is like the bloggers world. For so many years, so much people and fans, legal and so much people, other bloggers didn't want to pay attention to the warning signs, to bloggers such as myself warning you guys, can you knock it off? Can you stop with certain things? Not the drama, but like certain telling on each other, tattle telling, because it's going to lead to the flaggings, this and that. And then the flagging started back in 2016, not 2018. Nobody wanted to say nothing. You see what we got ourselves in? It's a never ending cycle. Think about it. Let's just say if you think it's me, I smoke hip hop. And after y'all think it's me, who else could it be? I mean, that's the logic behind most battle rap fans. They don't use the thing that's embedded inside their cranium, which is called your brain, num num. Love your family, love your kids, and stay blessed. Jesus. I guess next they're gonna blame President Obama. Next they're gonna say it's Donald Trump. These niggas, man. And taking a look at the long range forecast, continued snow, darkness, and extreme cold. This is Howard Hand Up Me. Good night. Goodbye. Don't forget to subscribe to Battle Rap Movement. Go to his YouTube page. Also subscribe to Mike Wave TV. And also don't forget to subscribe to Supreme Bates. These guys are great for the culture. Go subscribe to these gentlemen right now. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Good. Goodbye. Goodbye.